Now that's a very, very dangerous idea. You should stay away from your potential. I mean, that is something you should leave absolutely alone. Don't, di you'll mess it up. It's potential, leave it. And anyway, it's like your bank balance. You know, you always have a lot less than you think. So you don't look at it. You don't know. Leave it as a kind of, it's the locked door within yourself. And, and that's how it should be. Because then at least in your mind, the interior will always be palatial, you know? <laughs> Wonderful gleaming marble floors, brocaded drapes, mullioned windows covered in mullions, whatever they are. And <laughs> flamingos serving drinks. <laughs> Pianos shooting out canapes into the mouths of elegant men and women who are exchanging witticisms. Yes, this reminds me of the time I was in Budapest with Binky. We were trying to steal a goose from the casino. Pum, <laughs> Volvo! Don't open the door. Because it won't be like that. All you're going to see will be one tiny, grey, startling little cat with diarrhoea. Sitting on a mattressless, iron-sprung bed with its huge eyes mewing at you. <laughs> Smoking as well, probably. As, as an emphysemic landlady untangles her pop socks in the background. And some terrible guy, the color of an aubergine, rounds the corner holding a mug of beef tea, wearing a string vest and says, Man, <laughs> That's your potential. <laughs>